<laughs> G'day, everybody. Welcome to Saturday Night Love Song um, Show with actual musicians in the kitchen. Yay! Hello. Good to be here. It's we've a nice got, kitchen. We've got the lovely Michael Simic here. We've actually got perspex screens Moya. between us, which you can't see. Yeah, like invisible perspex screens. Yeah. We all have to face that way when we sing. And um, none, no, um, well, I did say you need to face a little bit this way. Oh, yes. But, right. <laughs> um, so we're ready, we're ready to rumble. I've got headphone things on. So if you, um, I can, I can. Oh, trip. that's what my feedback is. Oh, yeah, that's yeah. right. I might. Did, oh. did Phil get an intro or did I only get one? Yeah, Phil, I didn't. Did I introduce Mr. Phil, Phil Moriarty? Moriarty? I think I did, but Phil that's Moriarty, anyway. that's Hello. Phil. I can put these things on over here. That's right. I put them on my knee. I'll put the sound on my knee <laughs> for now. You feel the vibration. Yeah. <laughs> I thought we might open with a a, a Lucas Nelson song because um, I've Who, been learning it this week. Who's Lucas Nelson? He's, he's Willie's son. Oh, there you go. Yeah, would you believe it? Who is so, he? Willie Nelson's son. Oh. And um, I really love this song and I think it's a good sentiment. For the times, yeah, it was nice. She just played it to us. Just, just then. I was like, let's play this song to start with because right. you know it's best to like throw um, songs at people just before you go live to air. Yeah. It's a Clarence <laughs> too lad. Could you tell me on comments, please? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I believe that every heart is kind. Some are just a little underused. Hatred is a symptom of the times. Lost in these uneducated moods. I just want to love you while I can. All these other thoughts have me confused. I need to try to understand Maybe I'll get up, turn off the news Turn off the news and feel the garden Just my neighborhood and me We might feel a bit less hard We might feel a bit more free Turn off the news and raise your kids Give them something to believe in. Teach them how to be good again. Give them hope that they can see. Hope that they can see. Turn off the news and be a garden. It's like really bad storytelling. Like I'm up for a story, but they're bad stories told badly. 
I like to keep up with the COVID facts. So, yeah. Yeah. But but he's watching the news the best way to get them. I don't think so. That's all it's about at the no, moment. And, and to tell you the truth, Facebook, oh, sorry, I love you, Facebook, um, that, uh, isn't the best way to go about it either. <laughs> <laughs> That's what I said. Just turn off the news, go in the garden, hang out by yourself, mm. everything will be okay. Yeah. It's a good thing about living in Majors Creek is that ultimately you have to try quite hard to find someone. So it's a very safe place to be. Candle is bustling compared to Majors Creek. Oh, yeah, yeah. The cafe is on fire at the moment. Now, if anybody, I mean, probably better not to give me any This is the one we're doing with the cords that are for them, isn't it? Yeah, we're going oh, to do, do that. Yeah, yeah, sure. Yeah, let's do it. It's a bit, yeah, it's a bit nerve-wracking playing with other people. I, I suddenly went, oh. I like it. I know, it's, it's cool. It's nice that it's COVID has forced us to play together finally, Mel. And, 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 and just yeah, tell me what they are. The D, G, E minor, and A. Oh. The, other thing um, is, the other thing is, like, every other week I've been I've been like, in, having guests and I, and I have to press a button oh, when the other one talks. So, like, it's like oh. I, I feel like I need to press the button. To you in, just yeah. press my press shoulder. A, beep. Your turn. Yeah, Go on. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> I was feeling I should stay away because of the danger risk, but uh, then having to work the technology was... To more daunting. Was it? I, I like it. <laughs> I, I just want everyone to acknowledge the fact that there was a glaring dad joke there. And as a new father, I really wanted to say it, but I thought I wouldn't say, just don't press my buttons. <laughs> <laughs> we've got a few mates here. We've got, we've got um, Kirsten and Kate and Leonie. And um, also there's a few people I think on my on the other Facebook, which sometimes doesn't come through on this feed. But but um, Hi, people. Thanks for but, tuning in. Hey, on everybody. Night. Yeah. Mm. This is a little song I wrote not long after Sunny was born last year. So mm -hmm. she has some songs about her that are very obviously about the joy of a child and others that are just abstract songs about the nature of life, which this one fits into. It's called Eternity. Okay. <laughs> Of eternity, see another face of love. The world breaks open, everything's alive now and forever. Time passes by. Time stands still, time is everything, nothing at all. Time ties us up, time ties us down, time runs away with a song. Mistake. 
The clock on the shelf, the clock on the wall, the watch on your wrist, the time on your phone, can't hear our call. Time means nothing at all. Time is here for us all. I was busting for another chorus there. Yeah, right. yeah, really okay, different. three, four. <laughs> Time passes by. Time stands still. Time is everything. Nothing at all. Time ties us down. Time ties us down. Time runs away with a song. I like that dissonant ending. It's perfect. <laughs> Time has its way with the song. So yeah, yeah. The chords are not. That was fun. That was fun. What a trio. I almost, I, I, over in the other corner, there, there are shakers. Oh, shakers, yeah. I could, yeah. I could do it. We could I, be the new Peter, Paul and Mary. We could be, yeah. We'd be like, yeah. Um, yeah. Well, well, Phil, Phil, Mike and Melanie. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> nearly. Yeah, nearly Peter, Peter, Paul, so you got to go. Michael, Phil, and Melanie. Yeah, Michael, Phil, and Melanie. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. That works. Yeah, that the MPM. Yeah, I yeah. like that. Yeah, yeah. yeah. And then, dun, 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 dun. Yeah, yeah. All right, ready to rumble. Who we got now? We got Carmen, Jane, Jeff. Hey, Jeff. Jeff, put the fireplace in. You see that you're currently enjoying oh, it. There you go. Thanks, Jeff. We would be very cold without you. I hope everyone's enjoying yeah. the light display from Disco <laughs> 2000. We're very happy with ourselves. Oh, yeah. It's great. <laughs> I like, it? see, as soon as you put on. I've been I've been at home a bit on my own, and as soon as you put the fire on, that's pretty. That's like having one friend, and putting the fire on and the disco lights is like having two friends. And it's like it's like, like wow, it. what is that? Uh, <laughs> very nice presentation, which I had nothing to do with. I just arrived. <laughs> People can't see that. Like, if you take a photo from over there, there's sort of mounds of things in the distance, and then mounds and of then, instruments, and then there's like they? and then there's like and books. Like then nobody can see that. That all of the lamps are stacked on things in the and turned upside down in order to get achieve this lighting effect. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's what you've done. That's what I did. I like yeah. it. The last time I was here was years ago. It was when yeah. Dan Kelly played here. Oh yeah, yeah. it was. Cool. It was a lovely night. Yeah, it was a good night. Yeah. No, it's a way, my I house, just my I, house filming. Oh, was it? Yeah. Or well, I just think that there's always live music happening in your house. That's yeah. just the way I view it. <laughs> yeah. You know? it's, like, <laughs> it's not not a bad way to be. Losing <laughs> using the books for insulation too. Uh, Mm. That's a good idea. Yeah, yeah. I thought I'd bring you into the kitchen tonight. Instead of having a bookish night, I thought I'd invite you into the kitchen. I like it. Because it's, it's yeah, yeah. nice kitchen. Yeah. Very nice. You got a song okay. for us, Phil? Oh, yeah. I'm not yawning because I'm not interested. I'm yawning because I'm relaxed and really enjoying the atmosphere, which is what I do. I'm playing a song called Moonlight Flower, which, which I first really did with a, a band called The Last of the Broken Hearts. Yes. It was a <laughs> good then, band. But yeah. then the Gadflies recorded on their album. <laughs> Which I don't think any of you have got. That's just my guess. I just want you to know I played Last of the Broken Hearts on my radio show on Braywood FM this week. I oh, played yeah. She Wants You. Oh, yeah. Beautiful song. Oh, yeah, okay. She oh. wants you, she wants you, she wants you. Oh, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's me, yeah. And Jenna, Jimmy and Gemma going off in the background. Oh. <laughs> A good one. That's, you don't a, have, but that's a very, very limited edition album. It's, I feel very, uh, it's got like a hand, not only a hand drawn cover, it's a handmade cover, like folded like origami with a yeah. CD. Yeah, it is me and Christine and the girls folded that. And I think there's like five copies left at Canlo Books. Well, I hope <laughs> it's like so, the hidden albums are sometimes yep, the yep, gems. Yeah. <laughs> If oh, you've what? just played your new Grace's album to death and you can't listen to it one more time, go buy Lots of the Broken Hearts. Yeah. <laughs> Ready? Yeah. Well, one, two, three, four. Such a mystery.
Lovely. Thank you very much. Sneaky, like sneaky fade out. Apologies for the bridge. I very confidently played it wrong. You can quietly <laughs> play it wrong, but I really went. I also confidently played it wrong. So oh, yeah. did you? I did hit a C chord when I shouldn't have. Oh, and then I went, because oh, I hit the A yeah, there, and I went, I oh, was wrong. It must be a C. No, no, you were right. You were right. Oh, there you <laughs> hey, people, I just want that noted that there's a very good band dynamic here. We're people accepting responsibility for our own mistakes, you know. I was panicking because I realised that I'd done a version with Mel that was longer than that and didn't have the middle bit there. So I was I kind of went, oh, the middle bit's going out. No, no. I think that was a clever plan to throw me as well. Yeah, yeah. yeah if you go through one person, you That's how in touch you were with the vibe, though. You went, oh. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> it's good. Okay, just checking the sound with my... Oh, yeah. My pro ears. We're more boisterous now. That's so. good. Yeah, we've got. <laughs> all right. Yeah, you brought the rock and roll, fella. We were yeah. keeping it lullaby. Yeah, no, I like it. Like you got all sexy. I like it. What are we going to do? We're going to do. Well, we have to. We should do something. How like, about um, all that. I do is dream. Should we do that now? No, you can save it as an encore if you want, but I, you said it now. I said it. Did you just I've said, said it now? It. You said it now. But you said it after I said well, it. I think we you haven't done an original of yours yet, though. So. Oh, you haven't? No. Oh, yeah. So yeah, that's what we're here Yeah, yeah, okay, okay. All right. So let's do. Let's do um, I Learned How to Love from Love Songs. Great. What do you reckon? Okay. I'm going to try the accordion in this. You got it. So there's Mik Michaelis uh, is watching on YouTube and oh. um, the lights are amazing. Yay. Um, it, Kirsten's loving it. So if you if you have any peculiar questions to ask any of us, to, um, leave a message on here. Actually, uh, I think that the, let me have a look. I think that the Facebook that, is showing up is my uh, is is the um, the Melanie Horstall Music Facebook. So the questions that are showing up. But anyway, I'll, I'll see them there. If you've got a question, my friend from Castle Maine, Kirsten Crowth, is saying I'm loving it. So intimate. Thanks for tuning in, KK. She asked she asked earlier if she needed a date to come, and yes. I said you might meet the guy there. You might meet. I have to admit that what I started these um, online date nights. 
and and the the week that I started my Saturday night on night online date nights, you know, to sing to everybody, was the week that a really cute fella um, wrote to me on Instagram. So there you go. They're obviously blessed. Yeah, <laughs> so they're blessed. Who might that fellow be? Oh, he, he, he might be on the couch Look, anyway. <laughs> that's fantastic. Does he have a name? Or he hasn't, you you haven't got to that stage of the relationship yet. Yeah. You're just keeping it primal at the moment. Is, is my makeup all right? I was just wondering that. <laughs> yeah, they look like real glasses. Oh, okay. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and you know, date nights worked out well for Phil and I. We're both in committed relationships now, so thanks. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Thanks, date night. Date night. <laughs> date night does it. Yeah. So you can all talk um, in the in the little in the little side comment bits. If you talk to each other, there might just be a spare in there. You see. <laughs> yeah, totally, totally. There's eligible men and women and trans and everyone just kind of walking, crawling up and down the stairs. So yeah, it's a great place to be, people. If you're looking. <laughs> <laughs> oh, what are we doing? Are we done? We're, we're singing doing, a song, aren't we? So, did you learn how to love some love songs? I learned. I did. That's the problem. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. <laughs> Tonight we listened to, actually to before you come in. We listened to Everly Brothers, oh. and I realised that I may have been overly influenced by Everly Brothers. You got to watch out. The songs like you know, we used to have good times together. Yeah, you don't want to learn how to love from that. Well, that's the thing. Is I, realized, I suddenly <laughs> realised all of the, my like early love songs, and I can now really I up till now them slip away. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> I'm like, oh, hang on a second. So I learned how to love from mental as anything. Yeah, a lot yeah. more cheery. You know, if you leave me, can I come too? You yeah, know? yeah, and, yeah. And you're not together yeah. with me it was diana ross and the supreme so oh, oh wow yeah. uh -oh. <laughs> no, no, love <laughs> just have to wait yeah. mm. <laughs> that was more of a stop in the name yes. of love move yes. wow, i realized that oh emily brothers man wow. unless you were saying stop mm. don't hurry love <laughs> i think i think we're gonna we might play dream later but that's yeah. that un may have un sadly influenced me too much yeah. <laughs> but here we go we've got this one this is one of my songs called i learned how to love from love songs Okay, uh, um, I'll, just, I'll just play, okay? I learned how to live from Dylan And that's why I'm so shy I learned how to love from love songs But love songs only made me cry I took all I could from learning, but that never fed my soul. I took all I could from heaven, but I only crave drugging. Oh, every day I'm changing, and every day I try. I'll keep myself from wisdom. Every day before I die I had to be brave by driving Through some of the longest nights And I had to pretend to be happy Though that never satisfied I've seen sea light shine brightly but I'd rather leave by the sea Cause I've seen some shadows go quietly And that's not what I want to be Oh, every day I'm changing And every day I'm true I'll keep myself wasted Every day Yeah. <laughs> Good line, isn't it? Yeah. 
Oh, oh. you got such a beautiful voice. It's lovely to sit next to you and listen to you sing. Yeah, Just the other day, I was over at um at Fran and uh, Ken's place. My wife Rose's mum and her partner and yeah. remembering you singing at our wedding very kindly, yeah. which was lovely to have you there. I just remember that spot, <laughs> you beaming. It's hard singing did when everyone's tell, drinking champagne, you, but we like having you. Did you tell anybody the funny thing, my funny request? Um, what was that again? You well, were, I did, when, when, when you kind of wanted, you when were you, like. When I, you both go, when you were engaged and I saw the na- engagement notice, I was, I was a little bit dorky and I said, can I please come to the wedding? That's right. Yeah, <laughs> there are only about two or three people who, saying, who kind of said that. I remember being in a taxi with a friend in Melbourne yeah. who just said, well, you have to invite me to your wedding. Yeah. And I'm like, wow. Yeah, sure. Yeah. Okay. That's great. It's like, why not be forward? You've got to ask for the things you want yeah, in life. Yeah, 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 yeah. And so we thought, well, if you're going to come, we've got to put you to work. Yeah, yeah. That's it. I, was like, I, was I was like, that's great. Go. Oh, there's a puppy dog here, which you can't see under Hi, the Lena. table. He's playing the guitar with my with yeah, the tail. Yeah. Go, no, go cuddle Tom. Off you go. She's <laughs> wanted to come and say good day. She's cute. She's like, is dad here? Okay. So, here. what do we got next? Do we have another Mel song? Or are we getting in the same order? Okay. Yeah, as you like. So- yeah. Yeah. There's a song Phil and I were, had a little go at before oh, called yeah. River of Song. It's a little of a longer one, kind of a. Do you have to play You did, that's in A. And um, I reckon you'll be able to play along if you want. Same chords all the way. Yeah, I'll, I'll, I reckon I can. I can um, it's just uh, the. the uh, you just look out for the B minor in the chorus. Yep. But other than that, it's all pretty straight up. I might even um, I'm just gonna. It's got a lot of verses. I'm just gonna. We can, have we can a move. We can move the go, fruit. Oh, no, 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 do not move the fruit. I it's like also, fruit. I kind of liked the fruit on the screen. It looked Fruit's nice. Good. It looked good. I don't know why. I sort of. There's a few things here, like here's this Madeleine um, artwork that I really love. There's some really chocolate down there. I don't know if you can see that. There's chocolate down there. There's, mm. there's, it there's um, garlic, heaps of garlic for anybody. In case you didn't think we were rock and roll, we just had um, a dandy chai with oat milk. Thanks. And that's why we're fired up. Thanks, Tom. Beautiful dandy chai making. She just said his name. <laughs> Mott. <laughs> Mott. <laughs> <laughs> I wish my head was empty, but it will never be. These thoughts keep bothering me until one day they'll all slip away. Just for a moment, I'll slow it all down. Lay myself out on the ground by the river. I'll be free. Oh, oh, it's a river of song. Oh, oh, rolling along. Mary and Joseph are making love beneath the heavens above and a bright, bright star is enough to make you believe. Tom and Jerry and Attila the Hun draw their guns, bang, bang, pow, pow. We all fall down. But our spirits are dancing in the here and now. Oh, oh, it's a river of blood. Mm-hmm, a river of love. We pull the curtains, draw the blinds. Too bad if you're left behind, that's the way. Way it's gonna be. We walk in circles, we flip our burgers, we build our churches, but the walls come tumbling down, down on you and me. Oh, oh, it's a river of regret.
down the highway, the music plays. I'll know the words one of these days, and I'll be singing the same old song. Pull over by the roadside to choose another tune. There's no reception, so I put down my phone and keep driving. Driving into the sun. Oh, oh, it's a river of time. A river of stars. Now I'm feeling empty. I want to fill up. Sometimes I just don't know how to stop. So I keep going. I guess I'll work it all out Now I'm feeling full I can't move Too many options I can't choose So I do nothing And wear myself out Oh, oh, it's a river of dreams Broken, beautiful dreams. Stretch my mind, feel my breath as I slip through time. I got no idea of what's to come. Oh, oh it's a river of time. I wish my head was empty, but it will never be. These thoughts keep me company until one day they'll all slip away. And if life's a river, I'm a tributary, ebbing and flowing as I please. And one day I'll get to the sea. sometimes those songs just come out that just want to go for a little longer yeah i'm yeah, a big yeah. fan of three to three and a half minute songs yeah, but yeah. sometimes 
It's more to be said. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> but the, the key to more to be said is often just not trying to do it in a hurry. Yeah, yeah. Oh, oops. That was exciting. Oh, I need to go turn the water off. Do you want to entertain everybody for a second while I go turn the water off? Yeah, we can entertain everyone. It's fine. All right, let me run the second. Um, I don't know if anyone at home knows how to peel a banana, but I'm going to show you now. We can do that one. Are you going to eat a banana while No, we... no. <laughs> um, you know, the, Give me a second. Uh, uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. It sounds that great. One. So, so um, there's been a songwriting traditions of, of, of song clubs in Candelo for quite some time. I, I think found Mel a, started them all. Think she did. All? There's a breakaway one. Andrew's got one with Myung. Oh, uh, yeah, yeah. And then, and then Phil and Nick and I. Is this bad that I mentioned this? Is it meant to be secret? And that's fine. Mm. Okay. Anyway, someone suggests a word each week. You write a song during the week, record it, and send it back. Based on the word, inspired by the word, the word maybe ignoring the word, ignoring using the word. You can. You I know. thought I did pretty good with flow to not mention it much, yeah, yeah. Way, but it, there was something in there that got me going. <laughs> and now I, I suggested the word flow a few weeks ago. And it totally stuffed up Phil's flow. <laughs> You've been flowing with all the songs. You went, I can't get flow. I know it's because I had that Atlantis song. I was, I was having trouble with it. Oh, I got okay. a weird horn line. And I, I couldn't get it to keep going. I, was, you know, <laughs> I decided to really do my own song about Atlantis. You know because. The Donovan's wasn't enough on its own. <laughs> we haven't had a song about that lost city for a while. Yeah. But then there was a uh, thing on SBS about it. It was terrible. Oh, no. Really badly done doco. Yeah, well, I guess they just didn't have good footage, right? Uh, well, it, and it had all this. It was just sort of, you know, before the ads, the lost people of Atlantis, then it'd have a picture of someone that wasn't Aquaman. from Atlantis. And then it'd go to an ad. And when we get back, you're going to find out under the water. <laughs> oh, no. it was just I'm glad you stuck with it, though. <laughs> <laughs> So how many, how many? one week Phil suggested that we write a song, but that we don't send the recording, that we just send lyrics with chords next to them, or even not next to them, and then then we have to try to interpret the other person's song. And oh, my God, so that would be brilliant. So this is Phil's version of my song, which the original was quite nice, but his version's better. So it's a very good lesson for life that relinquish control and it, you will often be rewarded. That's one for you, Kirsten, if you're listening. I'm hoping you got your notes there and you can prompt me on my I do, I do. First verse. Yeah, yeah. Because we haven't seen each other. I haven't seen how long since I've seen you. Well, we saw each other at the pub, but that's it. The the pub? When you played at Task for Pub and me and Oh yeah, briefly, and, but that was last That was quite a while ago. September or something. Yeah, yeah. Was it? Yeah. That's I played guitar. I was playing we saw guitar. each other around. I like the fact in country times. I saw you eight months ago. <laughs> <laughs> no, because remember, I thought, we, I thought it was two years. Yeah, we I didn't realise. It's been two years since I've been to your house. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Well, do you need do you need do you need to be here? No, 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 no but, I but, but I reckon you could find some nice harmonies in I just here. Want to yeah, so, um, uh, your verse starts with "There's no way I can doubt it." Okay, thanks. Yeah. Okay. Got it. Yeah. Right, yeah. Got it. Got it. Oh yeah, I'm, I want my pick. Where's my pick? Oh, uh oh. Uh-oh. Uh oh, that's really good for that guitar line. Oh, oh there it is, there's one there, there's one there. there. Oh, there, there it is. Yeah, gold. Yes, it's, it's very good. well uh, camouflaged with the table. <sighs> Thank you, Andrew Gray. I stole this pick from you. No, I can doubt, no, I can doubt it. There's no way I can doubt it. How could you doubt that little? <laughs> there's no way. <laughs> uh, one, two, three, four. Thank you. 
That's it. So that's Phil Moriarty's version of a song I wrote, which was um, I can't remember my version anymore. <laughs> you, you, your melody's a little bit different. They're related, but yeah, yeah, you yeah, blew yeah. mine out of the water. Thanks for improving a song I wrote about loving my own life and my own family. You, <laughs> you made it better, even though you'd never even come and visit. <laughs> <laughs> so obviously, yeah. distance makes the heart grow fonder. Yeah. Apparently, it does. <laughs> <laughs> Absence, whatever. We got uh, mum and dad are there. Oh, um, got a, if you, so so vague. Oh, there was. I heard someone actually. There was a there was a query earlier on. Hi, Lee Elliot. There was some. Nice there was a you, query Lee. for you earlier on. I think somewhere in there. I don't know no, if I, you know on on the screen there, but we we get a representation that's the opposite. So it just looks weird when I do my hand there and it's over there. Going like it's this. thrown out our dance choreography. <laughs> we had awesome choreography. Yeah, we, had we can't do it with the flip. <laughs> somebody, uh, somebody did maybe tease you about your blanket. About my. Blanket. My blankie. <laughs> yeah, well, you lied to him and said it wasn't visible. It wasn't It wasn't visible when you got your guitar on you, but then you picked up the took guitar off you. And, and so I did decorate, we did decorate Phil it's with a blanket. It's not a blanket. It's a kind of a tartan um, um, it's a skirt. A kilt that I'm wearing. It's a long, it's a long, <laughs> long. The long clan Moriarty. <laughs> <laughs> Weren't you in Highlander? Oh, right. <laughs> yeah. in, in a weird blankety colour. Yeah. But the funny, the funny thing is, like, people don't really know. Like, so this house, it does have a wood heater. We finally got a heater. We're just and quite I, far away from yeah, it. And I, and I no longer have to wear, like, I no longer have to wear a snowsuit around the kitchen to cook dinner, <laughs> oh, no. which is brilliant. But the thing is, it still does have holes everywhere yeah. in the house. So, like, the heater then sucks the air, and so it's coming under the table and getting I your thought legs. that these Tibetan oh. prayer flags were for stopping the cold. Isn't yeah, that that's what they, yeah we, we talked to each other and... and it says, just be chill, Mel. No, I'm like, okay. <laughs> like we need it. to go put towels over the door holes, but it's okay. Oh, good. Do you have that... a song for us, Phil? Huh? Hey? Do you have a song for us? Oh, yeah, yes, yes. Um, do you want to give us a bit of rock and roll? I'm thinking of trying to do my rock song. Or well, maybe we'll try to do some gentle dance moves. <laughs> Sunshiny woman, take all my dark clouds away. Give me a lot of attention, keep all my demons at bay. But I would give it up tomorrow, give up my one night as two. If you would only.
If I stay here much longer, I'll only come to despise her. So much for good intentions, so shattered to leave. She doesn't deserve it, I know only too well. You must remember that one. Yeah, oh, I do. Do the, our songwriting that's, club. That's flaming cool. Oh, oh, I love that I like one. It. Oh, thanks. I might have to learn that I one. I think you deserve a mandarin. Mandarin. <laughs> <laughs> just anyone at home, just so you know, we're not going to run out tonight. Why aren't they on the table? They look lovely. <laughs> they really look lovely. Yeah, and if you're all here, you'd all get your own. In fact, if you bump into Mel in the street, if you live in the region, oh, I'd have to crack the whole seal. I don't know if I'm prepared to do that. Do you, do you want a mandarin? There's some there, aren't there? There's one there. Yeah, yeah. You yeah. Can have we're good. But we're sorted for vitamin C, people. <laughs> that's, uh, I, that's what I was thinking about. I was like, uh oh. That's a song. School that, holidays. That we live. We live near the border. I, I love you, Victorians, but we're just a little bit too close to the Victorian border. And um, it was school holidays, and I suddenly realised that maybe I might need to get some more vitamin C just in case. Oh. That's a that's a blur song. Surely sorted for. Mandarins and Dandy Chino. Oh, I can see Dad sending me a text message. It might be important. This one, we've got, this might be oh. a comment. You're um, adopted. Oh, no, sorry. <laughs> Could it be that I was too loud then? And oh, you know what it was? It's actually nothing to do with Dickie. Oh. It is that, Dad, it, can't you wait till afterwards? It <laughs> says, it says that, no, that the new Grace's Seasons is gone up in the radio charts, number 25 this week, which is fantastic. Wicked. 11 weeks in the charts. How's that? Uh, uh, like, it's so nice knowing someone who's had a record in the charts. <laughs> <laughs> I just thought that was all made up. Yes, yeah, so did I. <laughs> but, 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 but that's the indie like, charts. That, that was no. no. That's the that's that's the radio charts. And they're in, they're they're in the really aria well charts. In and and charts? we're and we're in the, we're number we were number I think um, eight I think in the in the aria country charts this week and we were number one a few weeks ago but number one forget number about one. the eight you were one number one yeah <laughs> but you know like the but fact that it's like they the the, crack the aria charts and it stays there that's like kind of like but you weren't just the crack. country charts you also were in the general charts yeah yeah yeah, yeah that's yeah. right i think you don't win an aria for this album there is no god <laughs> i'd love to go to the aria awards you know how you wanted to go to his wedding can i go to the aria awards <laughs> i went to the aria you're going to just make a I'm fool of yourself been. Oh, you got to abuse everyone, Phil. Oh, no. Hey, that's right. Oh, that's right. <laughs> I had to tell you about an Aria Award story. You're like little Richard, where's my award? I've been in this. Bit. No. <laughs> well, Tom Waits is like, what's this about the Hall of Fame? I want to get into the room. I'm sick of being in the hall. Let me into the room. <laughs> <laughs> what were you going to say? Yeah, I well, so I, years ago, like, um, I really was a little bit obsessed with oh, – Okay, so this is like maybe it's about twenty five, and I was a little bit obsessed with wanting to go to the Aria Awards. Yeah. Aria Awards, and so I found a way, but it involved me pretending to be a photographer and buying a ticket. Oh, and then I'm like, okay, I can't really do that, and so I didn't have enough money to do it. it was like five hundred dollars or something. I don't know what it was. I can't remember what it was. But so I went to because I worked at Woolies at the time, and all Woolies crew went down to the um, the Leagues Club in Manly, not Manly, Brookie. I thought you said the Legs Brookvale, Club. The leg I wish it was we called to, the Legs Club. We went to the Legs Club in Brookvale. Yeah, 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 yeah. And and I do not, absolutely do not play the pokies and I don't think it's a thing. But I may have walked over to the machine with $2 and put it in the machine with my little dream of going to the Arias. And I put it in the machine and I won 500 bucks. Wow. Which wow. is enough to go to the Arias and Buy a dress and have a kebab as well. And a the kebab on the way home. <laughs> <laughs> so, so, so I turn up and I've got like and I've got like my purse. So good. <laughs> well, I've got my purse. That's yeah. great. Full 
of my CDs, my first EP, I think it was. Yeah. And I ran around and I chased everybody and I gave my CD to oh, good everybody. On you. I gave my CD to the CD to um the fellas from Taxi Ride. Yeah. And and I love Taxi Ride completely. And they might even be some of the fellas Dan might they might be watching. Tonight, but so I think the interesting thing about different countries is I reckon if you went around and did that in America, people would go, She's got lots to get up and go, that girl. I yeah, like yeah, her. Yeah, yeah. And in Australia they'd be like can you back off? Yeah, like, like, <laughs> be cool. It's like I could be cool and die. But I was like, I was so shy. But I was still like this. But then forget my my next, old next door neighbor was like was on Cheese TV, and he happened to be Jet Jet. Oh, what's his name? Cheese TV. Cheese TV. So he was a personality, and like he was like you know like twenty five as well. And we're like, oh, you're here, you're here. Okay, can I follow you around? He goes, yeah, okay. So let's follow him around, and he talked to famous people, and I'd give him my CDs. Good so it was, like, it was good to have a teammate. Anyway. I'm not Sorry. picking it up. There's Cheese TV, there's Legs Club. I, <laughs> <laughs> I just want you to know the closest I've ever come to a gold record Something is in. Like fondue, chicken, I don't know. Yeah, the closest I've come to a gold record is in a toilet of a cafe in Sydney owned by Ken Gormley who played bass with the Cruel Sea. Oh, yeah. The gold record's just in the dunny. <laughs> <laughs> Oh. The honeymoon is certainly over when you're just dumping my gold record. Anyway, let's move we've on. got there's Lee there to say, Gay to you, Leone. Um, Hi, uh, and, Lee. and Kim, there's the, oh, there you go. There's, uh, good day, everyone. Um, I'll come, we'll come back and um, write messages to you all after. But I think we're all, we're all a bit chatty tonight. Bit yeah, fun. should we actually play a song? Should I play a song? Okay, let's do, let's do, let's do, let's do Everly Brothers. Oh, okay. Should we do it? Should yeah, we do yeah, that or not, really? <gasps> no, yeah. maybe we, let's do it really. Because probably, what have we got? I can't even remember how many more songs we've it got. It takes me a minute to find the harmony. No one panic. <laughs> of course, people don't realise that Everly Brothers really accordion was central to their sound. <laughs> yeah. I I um I don't know what I'm going to do after this though, because this is like like bringing the big song to the. We've got, we've got, we've got, I don't know what I'm going to do for my in closing one, but we'll work it out. It's okay, we'll work it's gonna it out. Be great. Yeah, it's going to be fine. All right. So I love this song so much. This is a brilliant one. Um, shall I do, I'll just one, two, three, four. Dream, 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 when I want you in my arms, when I all your charms whenever I want you. All I have to do is dream, 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 dream. When I feel in the night, when I need you to hold me tight, whenever I want you. All I have to do is dream. I can make you mine, just your lips of wine, anytime, night or day. Only trouble is, gee whiz, I'm dreaming my life away. I need you so, that I might die, I love you so. And that is why whenever I want you, all I have to do is dream, 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 <laughs> I'm just waiting for another bridge. I was like, I nailed the chords One, of the bridge. One, two, three, four. <laughs> I can make you mine, test your lips to one, anytime, night or day. All in trouble is, gee whiz, I'm dreaming my life away. I need you so. But I love you so And that is why whenever I want you All I have to do is dream Dream, 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 dream Dream, 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 dream Dream, dream Oh, 
playing that song. Fame and hell. That is on the very hard to get um last of the broken hearts. Oh my god, it is, it is. I'm just gonna hold on to mine so I can buy a house with it. Um hen's teeth is not a strong enough metaphor to no 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 describe the rarity of that record. It's really fun trying to play accordion that quietly too. It's sort of a bit like walking on hen's teeth eggshells. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Which is fun. Well, like for an instrument that can be quite bombastic. It's very beautiful. Bombastic's a great it can word. be gentle. All right. Um, Dad. What do people want to do now? Dad likes it. It's good. Great. Hey, Dad, can we not have any other distracting texts, please? <laughs> About her other band? <laughs> Where the new New Graces? M M P M. Where the, where the New Graceless? Oh, sorry. No. Oh, Mum. It was Mum who said it. Mum said, my boyfriend gave me that record. What a good boyfriend. But she said it from your dad's yeah, account. Yeah, Sharon. No, because it's Jeff Sharon Hustle. Oh, Jeff. They've got a, they've got a oh, shared I thought account. that was an interesting middle name. <laughs> <laughs> I think Sharon's a lovely middle name for a man. <laughs> it's, well, I'm not going to giggle because someone probably has got Sharon as their middle name and yeah. I'll be quite. Oh, someone there's got the CD. Yeah. Well, I'm going to have to kill you to make mine worth more. <laughs> Sorry, Christine. I had a record by Sharon Shannon called the uh, something Galway Girl. Yes. And I thought it was Sharon Shannon, sung by a man, but it's actually Steve Earle. Sharon's playing something like the violin or something. Like oh that. yeah, yeah. Uh -huh. the, she's the she does the. Oh, she does the that. Box. Yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. Oh, gotcha. Anyway, I yeah. confusingly thought that was a Sharon man for quite a long time. Yeah, yeah. I did <laughs> actually. Think, I did actually think that as well. So, so, no, so same, okay, it's okay. What's that song? Uh, Got away on a moonlight shadow, oh, which yeah? you would think is what's the tubular bells guy. Yes, because uh, it's credited to his name. There's oh, a woman singing. Uh, yeah, yeah. Uh, but, but she should have her name. Mike right? Oldfield. Yeah, yeah, it's like uh, yeah. Mike. You don't sound like Mike. That's like those uh, producers who have lots of lovely singers on their album, and then it's the Dave something album or something like that, yeah. and they're the producer and they played the keyboard or something and produced it. But yeah, uh, yeah. There's yeah, a yeah. lot of that going on in the late '90s. Imagine, <laughs> imagine what would have happened if now they did that to Ella Fitzgerald. Yeah, like yeah. like. Did you say well, Elephants Gerald? They elephants, sort of did yeah. at first, didn't did they? they? Did they just say Yeah, because oh. Billy Holiday and Elephants Gerald are in the Benny Goodman band featuring, and they'd only get one verse of the, it would be like instrumental, instrumental, one verse, a chorus, instrumental, instrumental out. Well, that's cool, though, because yeah, yeah. they are the instrumentalists. Kind of but yeah. they they were just yeah. featured artists. They weren't, you know. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I, I would like headline. it. If anybody out there would has a big band and – Wants to make a big band record with me singing, please tell me. You'd have to just to, do a verse. Please, what? I want to be in one. I want to be in oh, a. Oh, we did not particular songs. You got like, just want to do like a like a big band album. Oh. It'd be fun, wouldn't it? Wouldn't it be ridiculously fun? No, yeah. <laughs> and it's got orchestra as well. The 30s big bands. People forget about that. They think it's all mm. 40s. But mm. it's like, got started. I mean, there's great 40s big bands up, but it's all started getting really brash. But the arrangements and all of the 30s stuff. So good. Right. Mm. It's a real high pop music that is forgotten, I believe. Mm. That Between the Wars era. There's some sort of thing where early, so Benny Goodman when he started, he became the you know the king of swing and all that. But his early stuff, and he was Jewish. His style had a kind of klezmer vibe yeah. in the early stuff, which yeah. seems to have gone. It got slicker after that, but the mm. early stuff's got a weird yeah. European flavor to it. Which I quite yeah. like. I read a good book. I recommend my mother's son-in-law, right. uh, Benny Good across through it's Billy Holiday singing it. Sounds great. Oh, I okay. you know, listen to that Sounds before good. bed tonight. Yeah. yeah. There's a great book about John Hammond, the original producer, John yeah. Hammond, uh, who he produced albums for like Billy Holiday, mm. Count Bassie, through to Buddy Lenny Cohen's first album, Bob, uh, Dylan? Bob oh. Dylan's first album, uh, like across like four decades. Yeah. But his way yeah. was he could hear what someone that someone had something good but no one in the industry would pick up on it yeah. and he'd just get them into the studio get the get the um record label to pay for it and then he'd just read the paper and tell them to do what they do oh, yeah. you know it was genius yeah, no yeah. one never do their second album with him but maybe they would their career might not have kicked off without the guy who just let them do their thing as it was yeah. There, yeah, you know? yeah and he put together the first interracial band on stage he was so determined that it had to be the thing because as a kid he'd been hanging out in Harlem, seeing swing bands from when he was, and there were no white people there, but because he was nine or ten, they let him come in. Yeah. You know? It's like yeah. he's just a kid, and so he was just like, "This is the best music in the world." Yeah. And there's a Teddy Wilson, a piano player, yeah. and he just kept saying to Billy, um, to Benny Goodman, "You got to play with this guy. He's great." And he was like, 
and apparently all the black and white players after their gigs would all play in clubs together but mm. they weren't the they were the underground gigs yeah. you know yeah. but they were like there's no way we can do that on stage we'd lose our following we'd get booed off stage yeah, it was serious yeah and um but he just wouldn't take no for an answer. He just invited Teddy Wilson and his trio along and put them on stage during Benny Goodman's set break in a massive venue. Mm. Benny Goodman was like, I'm going to kill you. I'm oh, really? I'm going to kill you. And then the audience loved it. Yes. And, and it's like yeah. John Hammond just had that thing where he was really lovely and supportive, but he had this dogged thing of going, I think this needs to be done, mm. yeah. you know, uh, but not in a kind of awful way. And he just knew that people needed to hear that music. And yeah. then yeah. Benny Goodman was like, you're so lucky. Yeah. That worked. Okay. We're going to yeah. do it. And then they toured together. And it's great. Yeah, well, yeah. yeah. He was in there. Wow. I'm sure Teddy Wilson was in that Carnegie Hall live concert. That Probably. Yeah. 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 yeah but I, I've, only Famous got, I've only got pockets of great information. It, and it sits, it, it's a drift in a sea. Yeah, importantly, it's got, it's got, it's got, it's got sing, sing, sing up. Is this yeah. interesting, people? You know what's funny is every time you wiggle, the whole screen wiggles. Oh. That's yeah. cool. Look, it's kind of cool. Power. To get this when you're rock and roll song, when you're rock and roll song, it's going. <laughs> <laughs> well, you got to you got to tune for us, Mike. Oh, I, I probably do. What, were there any other ones we looked at, Phil, or should I just lay another one on you? You did the Dark Moon one. Oh yeah, let's do that. And I think I played a C harmonic. Is that right? Is that, that you one? did? Oh, yeah, okay. that was. It. And I don't and know. It's like looking at the moon here, but similarly, the moon Moodly Rages the Creek one. is great. I, I have think... sublime peas. I, I get a pea outside and I get to see every phase of the moon. It's, yeah. it's a beautiful thing. So. I'm planting some snow I... peas at my place. Is that what? Yeah. <laughs> I was thinking, just checking this, I think this I think this is the last round, do you think? Or do you want to go one more after this? I don't mind. Well, let yeah, let the guess. people speak. Let the people speak, okay. So, yeah, cool. We can all have blankets. That will keep us going for a while. <laughs> um, this... They're simple chords, but it's got a few changes. This oh, one, so I'm probably unless you wanted to just solo along, or you can vocalize along. Yeah, I might like. vocalize. Anyway, this is one written when the night when the moon wasn't there. Tonight the dark moon and a billion stars. Lighting up the night Things will be alright You don't have to be afraid Of the dark Tonight the dark moon Is calling to you And all 
all to be. You can see in the light of the dark moon. So nice playing with harmonica. Yeah. It's good it's instrument. Such a moodly. <laughs> mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> I like it. I like it. Walk it. This has been it such is. a pleasure. I don't know yeah. about you. I haven't played music with anyone for quite a long time. Yeah, now. No, it's yeah. actually really special to we've, be here. We've yeah. been getting like that that little kind of wobbles of, and also like being in PR land, like you know, plugging the record and stuff. I haven't been able, you know, playing on Saturday nights, but like playing with people and mm. yeah, it's that's nice thanks for inviting us yeah mm. it's cool thanks for coming i mean it's very on, the, handy on the that, screen would be awesome but also this is like double it's handy awesome. that i spontaneously decided to come down the coast yeah the same day that you yeah so yes. let's do a gig Good spontaneous like, uh you know adventure Ooh. Mm. Oh, well, well yeah what do you got phil i've got that my ocean one oh, yeah, let's yeah. Do that. leave them on a low <laughs> Oh, no, yeah. we can keep going. We go. I reckon. Oh, good. What do you reckon? I reckon. I reckon we do this one, and then we do one more. Oh, okay, you correct. That's yeah. good. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That? Sounds yeah. great. Oh, a bit of Mandarin. Is that my um, beverage over there? Mm -hmm. Okay, merci. Did I play? He played accordion? the other thing. Yeah. Mm. Have you said well done? Very soothing. Who said that? That's a nice thing. Soothing is good. Yeah. There's a lot of unsoothing things in the world. And if we can provide some more soothe. Hey, hey, hey. I'm a bit south of the border now. Talking fiddling music. Yeah. We're ready now for the. I enjoyed that. This is an A minor, right? Yep. Yeah. Yes.
Or you could move to a country where you're allowed to be sad. Let out a story that you nearly went mad. A hard time that you had. Trying not to turn out like you down. Children playing in the sunshine Bring no relief to the trouble in your mind Oblivion seems a better answer Than waiting around till you grow a cancer It's so hard to strike a balance between the darkness and light. I wait here with you. Do you think that you might find something to hold on to on this mystical night? We won't pretend. It doesn't matter who's always right You're my friend Anything you do is all right That's a beauty. That's a lovely one. Isn't it? Oh, well, I mean, well, I it's very you're... sad, but it's very pretty. <laughs> well, and yeah. happy. So. And yeah. also featuring on the uh, Last of the Broken Hearts. This is like a Last yeah, of the Broken it's... Hearts reunion without. Yeah, well, it should be yeah, like right? a Last of the Broken Hearts. I love like yeah. the fact you can remember your parts. So yeah, like, yeah. Like, <laughs> like how many couple yeah. of gigs yeah. two years ago? Yeah. More. 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 Three. Oh, oh it's, it's got to be four. It's like the best band name. It was like a band name I held on to ever. Yeah. It was, and actually, no, it was when I was living in Tarthra with Rose for six months. Yeah. It was that, so it was 2016. Right. Mm. Mm. I remember playing it in the stereo oh. there. Oh, I do. Well, maybe, you know. Yep. There's something might. Eh? So, you know, the, the evolution of that band mm. could be something. There could be a thing. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You yeah, never yeah. know what might appear. Yeah. 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 Um, and, you know, and what you were saying about the sad, you know, it's like but it's, but you it's have beautiful. to, but you have to give voice to those emotions. It's what yeah. makes you balanced, oh, and, so and cool. things get out of balance if you don't. And yeah. that's when people do horrible things to themselves. And yeah. Well, also, you, if you're writing songs, you're trying to address something, and you don't always get it totally right. But you're just trying to express mm. something yeah. that gets near something. You know, it's not yeah. always like spot on or yeah. But also, like, but you, imagine if we imagine if we only listen to happy songs, yeah. it'd be a bit weird. It's like the, the, the moments are it's terrible, but I, I, I write songs mostly when I'm sad. Mm-hmm. And when I'm happy, I'm just having a lovely time being happy. And then time to write a song. And then I'm like, oh. <laughs> the tempo of that song too, it really, really lets great. you sit in it. It mm. really doesn't yeah. rush on. And yeah, it yeah. lets you sit in the emotion. And uh, it's a beautiful thing. Hope you enjoyed it. I love that one. Oh, mm. well, I guess we could go sad again. Well, right, hang on. And you, you, you probably know this, but I'm going to plug Mel's Patreon page. If you're not a patron of Mel, it's worth doing because she's an incredible creative artist, as you know. And her and other people inspired me to start up one six weeks ago. And I'm saying this now because I think Phil, 
if you had one, I would subscribe. Well, but what are you doing? Do you put you things on. Put it? up those songs that you do with yeah, Song yeah, Club yeah. every week. You can do what you want. Yeah, like, yeah. But I just share an, a song each week. Sometimes it's a studio recording. Sometimes it's a home recording. Sometimes it's new. Sometimes it's an archive thing. Okay. I think people might find interesting. I write a bit about it. And I do a, a one half hour live streaming gig a week, mm. you know, but you don't have to do that if you don't want. Right. Um, you do what you want, but it's ultimately, there's lots of people who love your stuff. Yeah. It's, it's not competitive because it's all about the people who want to support you to do what you do and it gives yeah. you money to keep being an artist. Ooh. It's a lovely loop of. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Well, I, I, um, I, I um, need to do my monthly post. I got a bit behind because I had this great idea that you know when we all got into lockdown that I would suddenly be able to create lots of things, mm -hmm. but uh, that I had the girls at home mm, and suddenly right. and yeah. and then trying to do homeschool I'm like uh oh, so I like and release the record so I was like all out record release yeah. and homeschooling and I didn't create anything at yeah, all. That's right. So now that well, hey, you can school, you you, could, you two could even like release a last of the broken hearts song each week. You've already yes. recorded them and not many people have heard <laughs> yeah, them. Yeah, yeah. 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 Like, yeah, yeah. I, I had an old remember that old solo album of mine that we worked out songs from it in the first iteration of the Black Sea Gentleman. And I've yeah. never I'd like done two hundred hand made versions but yeah. never released it oh, and i just like uh, gave that to people when they signed up because i'm like it doesn't really exist anywhere else you know and just you find you've got stuff in the shoebox you know? yeah there's like i've got like about 150 songs apparently spare according to apra that are yeah. just hanging about well i don't know about you i use it as an opportunity to get me recording my new songs because sometimes yeah, you're kind of yeah. waiting to make the album and the beautiful thing about patreon is you're sharing stuff as you make it yeah which is such a great way to share yeah, it. It's really cool. and i've found people really appreciate it and engage mm. with them so. oh, yeah It'd be great i love to yeah, come and come and join in. Well, uh, yeah, if I lived down here, I would babysit your kids so you could work on the song. Yeah, well, now yeah. they're back at school, oh. so I can maybe start to um, blossom my brain a little. Bit. Blossom your brain. Yeah, come on, little brain. Come on, brain blossom. I'm the opposite. I've been in the studio of mine every day for three months. That's a bit, yeah, like just I, doing I, stuff. I've got heaps of mates who are like who yeah. just like on their who are on their own, and so like it's a great blossoming period. But it was like the opposite for me, and then. It should hopefully tip around, and you know we'll all flip it about. I bought a saxophone. Yeah, that's what's. Awesome. It's just annoying. It's just become a conversation. I, <laughs> I'm finding it really interesting, but you guys might have all left. <laughs> no, they're still there. They're like you know hanging on. <laughs> now fine. we're gonna. Yeah. We're, I think we'll do like we'll do one more. We'll do one more round, and then and then and then I might try and sing something that I really have got no idea about the just to close it off. What do you reckon? Yeah, I think that's a brilliant idea. Yeah. I think Kate Bush would love that. <laughs> Kate, Kate will go, yeah. Well, it's, it's, there's a wacky chord there. So so we'll go around. I'll play one Kate's more. Kate's a wacky songwriter. Yeah, she, she, she'll love it. Well, do you have a go of Falling or do you have a yeah, go of, yeah. of, um, of Blue Butterfly? Let's oh, do Blue, Blue Butterfly. Blue Butterfly is a song of yours. Yeah, it's one of mine. So we can probably do a little um, accordion maybe. Sure, it. Okay, Maybe that key, or I'm bringing up, bringing up. Oh, really? That one? Like yes or no? Down one one? I could do it, the one you did. The first one? I'm not sort of figuring it out. Ah, da, 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 da. Does it sit on that or does it have to change this? We did it at the four wings one time. Is that okay or is that terrible? Is that what chords to play? All right, so we're going to do one called Blue Butterfly. Is that good for you, Phil? Yes. All right. I'm facing away to bring the clown out of the out of the um, spitting zone. That's good, actually. Put some, put some it over there away from the microphone. Okay. One, two, three. Right. Oh, I get the words. I love my blue butterfly Walks the streets at midnight 
He speaks about the revolution. Blue eyes brightly determined. We find music in the small corners. Tattered arms and graffiti words. We stamp the pavement with umbrellas. Gathering men to sing our chorus. Stop on the street lights to kiss There's so much he needs to tell me A city that has just been broken Opens wounds and must be spoken So we greet the people Work to keep the streets clean we shout that there is always love Brought a song above the traffic I will of the sun Now the day's just begun But we the overtired tired soldiers come up softly into each other This war is softened with a whisper A gentle song that falls to Did we play too much? It was beautiful. I loved it. I love the moments where we all stop and just hear you. They're my favorite moments. I mainly play so then I can hear myself stop again and hear you. Yeah, it sounds it's odd. So, yeah. Well, that, that, <laughs> that song I wrote, I, wrote, I wrote the song in Paris, and, and so so it was like the perfect um, sort of, you know, perfect amount of uh, things. The whole point was this sort of song that you can lean on the bar at 5 o'clock in the morning yeah. after a big night and – you know, like yeah, people there come was, in. There's yeah. an old friend of um that uh, Phil and I used to work with the Spiegel Tent. He did the lights tour into the Spiegel Tent for years. Called Willie. He's uh he's uh Scottish French. Mum's French, I think. Mm. Dad's Scott, or vice versa. But he and his partner at one point went to Paris and set up the bar that everyone wants to go to in Paris. The bars you want to go in Paris don't exist anymore. And the French don't know how to run them because they're running. It's Paris. People are just going to go to your bar anyway because they're in Paris. So no yeah. one puts the effort to make a bohemian, amazing place that stays open all night with people playing music. Yeah. They eventually went broke. But before they did, it was one of the, no, probably the best bar I've ever been to. Yeah. And, and I, I, he said, well, we've got an open mic on the Monday if you want to turn up. And I was like, I'm doing shows in London. I'm going to come play your open <laughs> mic, you know, ego. And then turn up and like amazing musicians. And they just like backed me. Yeah. And then Claire sung songs. I'm like, this is amazing. Yeah, and like the musicians of Paris are just insane. Yeah, They're so and amazing. Literally, people are there jamming good, high quality all night. To yeah. fly away. We'd walk yeah. home and get pastries, eat breakfast, and go to bed. Yeah, I'm like, yeah. it's good to just have a week of that. I think years yeah. of it, you'd be really sick. Yeah. <laughs> but for a week, it was like, wow, this, this world exists. It's yeah, beautiful. Yeah, 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 I got yeah. to go to Willie's um, 
Fire was a fair Yeah, one. yeah. I did get to play at Ned Kelly's though once. Ned <laughs> Kelly's. <laughs> I played there one night. Ned was French or <laughs> French <laughs> Irish. <laughs> we, we we got into the Irish Kelly's. pub. We were busking in the Irish pub guy got us. Yeah. <laughs> oh, 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 oh. That's why it was uh -oh. stopped by the Lamp. Oh, the cord. Careful with the lamp. Ah, yeah, ready? I'm, okay, I'm, gonna, to... I'm, gonna, I'm gonna come over there. It's, oh, no, it's okay. It's okay. It's we got right. it. We it's got, right. got it. It's a yeah. Uh, last week I. There's a bit of a. We needed some climax for the excitement of the game. Ah, oh, well, I think cold? it's um. I am cold. It oh, is cold. I, it's cold. I thought I was the only one. No, no. <laughs> Why do you think I've kept myself zipped up the whole show? <laughs> you, you can put your jacket on. Oh yeah, I know. Why don't you put your That's jacket on? It's okay. It's, it's rock and roll. <laughs> Oh. Okay, no, no, are we at the end? Who's someone who's singing your song? Someone's that's got that's some Denko rub, I can just put on the leg. You can play one, one you, you play oh, one, and then sure, I'll just sure. close with the with the very uh, maybe peculiar version of, of that. Of that thing. Yeah. So what are you going to play? Despite the change temperature, my nylon string lights in here. It doesn't need to be tuned. It can be quite thingy about temperature changes. It's, um, Maybe it's because it's the same temperature in here as it is outside and it was yeah. in the car before. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> I know. <laughs> <laughs> Did we rehearse anymore or should I just drop one on you? Drop away. Drop. What, do you want me to play something or not? Oh, it it would play. be a shame to all three of us yeah, be yeah. here and to not all play. Yeah, okay. But what? I've got so many million songs. Which one shall I do? Which one shall I do? No, I want to do. I want to do an oldie. Yeah. This is on the first Black Sea Gentleman album. This is a song called I Will Follow You. All right. It's in A minor. You could play clarinet or harmonica, whichever you wanted. You'll be fine. <laughs> you, you, you know it. Yeah, yeah. This is the reason I like to keep playing this song as it feels like a very direct connection with our first violinist David Branson oh. he used to do quite beautiful but strange solos in this he'd lose track where of where he was and yeah. then try to catch himself and they with some dynamic moments on stage he could do he could sort of he's the only person that could sort of turn left and stop and then go again in a solo that was kind of like that <laughs> totally he'd make it into part of it yeah 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 If you want to play along, quite simple chords, you might I would follow you anywhere. Us and the gates of hell, the darkness of despair. I would follow you anywhere. Beneath this sheltering moon, it's a change. there's a place where the tangled forest meets the sea. The waters, they are awash with hope and drown all misery. I would follow you. Into the heart of the sun to see what's there. I would follow you anywhere. I would grow wings and fly just to meet you on the cold, cracked cliffs and share a fire or oh, to dance with you above the town on top of the tallest spire
Landscape in it, that song yes, for me. Yes. I yeah. like that about it. <laughs> wow, what a pleasure. Thank you, Mel. No worries. For inviting us. No, it's cool. That's a beautiful thing. You want to sneak another one in there, Phil, before uh, departure? Oh, I'm oh, sounds great. Oh, that's right. I did have one. Oh. You play. Thank you for, thanks for coming, you know. Thanks for spontaneously. Here we are. You know, in some bands. In some bands. We can, yeah, yeah. yeah. Actually, that's it's a date fun. night. I don't want to do a date night on a screen. Yeah, it is great, yeah. yeah. It is pretty fun. We've fired up the spa, and who knows what could happen. It'll be a long night. <laughs> the sauna at the back in the hole. That's cold. right. Bubble yeah. bar. <laughs> Like my dicker, come off in the water. We've been going back to Seinfeld, and it's, there they are all sitting in a sauna, and Kramer's like, it's like a sauna in here. <laughs> that was quite funny. You've got a song called Painted Into a Corner as well, haven't you? Or is it? No, you've got one with Hello High Water in it. That's right. Yeah, Hello High Water. Yeah. This is called Painted Into I've a Pony. got a song called Painted Pony. Oh, all right. <laughs> Take your pleasure as they come Though we've only just begun This time we're heavy on you now We said you could change somehow Paint it into a corner And everything is fine I was foolish I suppose Got myself A lethal dose Wish I'd turned Away right now Back when we Were still just Thank you for coming. I hope you enjoy the show, but now we gotta go back to my hotel room. Maybe catch a movie or two. Dial some room service in. Such a sweet thing. Going 
Do I mind? Okay. Through the morning mist, the road unwinds. Thoughts of her go through my mind. Someone to chase my blues away. Keep her smile for only me. A sense of belonging. Sadly, now we say goodnight <laughs> to each and every one. <laughs> I can pill a leaf. Oh, we'll be back next Bye. week. We'll all have more fun <laughs> watching Melanie and her friends. What is this? And oh. the good times never end. You know what's going to happen next week? It's actually next week I'm playing my first live gig in Sydney. Oh, really? To just 20 people. Oh. Oh, There's wait, only 20 tickets else? available. At, at the at, a, at this beautiful um, new venue, it's actually my, it's a friend's bookshop and um, record store, mm. which has now just been converted into a venue in Kings Cross oh, in Sydney, yeah. and it's beautiful and they're just gorgeous. So, um, so if, I'll, I'll I'll do the PR if you if you're in Sydney, there's only twenty tickets for date night in Kings Cross. They're four hundred dollars um, each. Seven, uh, they're fifty dollars oh, each. Right. It's a steal. Well, that's a bargain. Yeah. It's a bit of a, like there's only twenty seats, and and if so, that means next week I think you have to tune in to date night a little bit earlier at seven p.m. Um, I don't even know if I'm going to live stream it. I don't know. I don't it's know. I'm thinking about it because if you really want to get lucky with someone, like for me, I'd be yeah. tired. I just want to go to bed now. Yeah, yeah. Like, you know, so it's going really well. But... Yeah. I'm past my best. Yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> Seven o'clock, it's like the end of the gig. I'm like, hey, yeah, yeah, yeah. Let's go out for a shandy. It's 8.30. Yeah. Are we going to get together or not? Because yeah, <laughs> yeah, yeah. I could still catch a movie. <laughs> <laughs> or two. I guess yeah, that's yeah, it. I can still watch Netflix. So if you're in Sydney, um, buy a, grab a ticket. They're on my the little link on my page. Um so, yeah, there's only 20 tickets. I think there's only 12 tickets left at the moment. So. I really want to eat a banana yeah, on can, screen. Yeah. <laughs> I don't, I, I've eaten a lot of bananas in my life. I don't know if I've ever done it for people. I mean, people have seen me, but I don't think they picked it up as a performance act. You might have to pay some uh, uh, royalties to Ignatius Jones. Is sort of the only thing. I, oh, I was thinking that. royalties to Andy Warhol, actually. <laughs> I shouldn't do this because, like, you're, you guys are here. We should do something that we could do all together. Oh, I'm kind of happy no, we're happy to listen well, to you. We've done lots together. Okay, well... well I'll just eat a banana during I'll do a banana solo. Just tell me when the solo is and I'll eat the banana then. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> this is okay, this is an art, this is an art piece. All right, we're gonna have banana eating yeah. and I'm going oh. to try and sing 
a Kate Bush's um, man with a child in his eyes. You and know what? It's a warning if you're triggered by fruit or eating fruit. <laughs> turn away now. I don't actually know if I can play it, so we're just going to just go with it. I believe and you can. I can't play parts of it, but I can play what other parts of it. these weird chords? Is this weird chords in it? And this chord sheet is all wrong. I tried to learn a Lynn Cohen one the other day and I just went, I had to give up. Which one, Phil? So uh, let's let's enjoy this like little tiny weird sorry, attempt. Karen, I'll think of it. Which I'll one is it? it? Do you hey? know? The Lynn Cohen one. Oh, no, it's one. Well, I think I should I should I should say um, good night, everybody. He probably knows it. Yeah. Yes. Good night. We can and, have this conversation after. Um. Thanks, Michael Simic, and thanks, Phil Moriarty, and um. Thanks, Melanie Holstrom. You yeah, can you can Mel. go to their links to buy their music and listen to things. Um, mm. I put I put a little link up the top, but there's probably more links if you go to their Facebook page and follow them and ask them lots of questions. Mm. So I'm going to try to do this. Okay. Mm. It's all right, isn't it? It's fine. I hear before I go to sleep, focus on the day that's been. I realize he's there when I turn the lights off and turn over. I'm so worried about my man. They say he's lost on some horizon And here I am again, my love Wondering what on earth I'm doing here Maybe he doesn't love me I just took a trip on my love for him Oops, weed cord there Oops Ooh, he's here again Man with a child in his eyes. <laughs> Ooh, he's here again. Man with a child in his eyes. He's very understanding and so aware of the moment situation. And when I stay up late, he's always waiting, but I feel him hesitate. Oh, I'm so worried about my man. <laughs> they say, I'm going to get it all wrong. They Don't say, no, me. no, it won't last forever. And suddenly I find myself listening to a man I've never known before. Maybe he's lost at sea, or he's lost to eternity. Ooh, he's here again. The man with the child in his eyes. Ooh, he's here again. The man with the child in his eyes. <laughs> Oh, All right, it's beautiful. That was the definitive version of that. It was like <laughs> I love it. <laughs> last night when I was sitting by myself by the fire, I got all the chords right, but just then it just imploded. But it's okay because it was the spirit no, I, of the yeah, song. It. It's uh, the feeling, yeah, right? You reminded me of one time, like getting up impromptu at the opera house with my friend Amanda Palmer. <laughs> And she wanted, wanted to do formidable marinade, but she didn't know. So I quickly showed her the chords there in front of two thousand people, and then, um, and then, and then she proceeded to kind of just play her own version with her feet and stuff. And I'm seeing it, and it went quite well. We were pretty together, and she yeah. kind of got it. And she got another guy playing marimba and stuff. But then there's a great moment at the end where I just got to do the big ending, and then she like thinks it's over and just starts drinking a wine. And then I like come back in to bring it all back in and she's like, oh. <laughs> and then she's like, I really love that. Do you mind if I put that on an album? I'm oh, like, yeah. why not? <laughs> <laughs> it's as good as any other version in its own way. <laughs> There's room for that in music. I think we sometimes get too tight about it all being perfect. Yeah, and it's like and, and being tight about imitating, like you said, when, you know, like you wrote a song and then you just got the chords and then you made a version of the song. So we just like, I just made another version. A version. Yeah. <laughs> All right. okay. Lovely. Well, good night, everybody. Night, night. Thanks so oh, much. Thanks for attending. Thanks for tuning in. Thanks for tuning it's great in. to have you here. 
um, you know, it's, uh, talk to you soon. Night, night. Good night. <laughs> Pressing the button. Bum, bum. In broadcast. Bye. <laughs>